back to another video it's your favorite baby girl wit and in today's video as you guys have already read from that title i am going to be giving you guys a haul some of these items i purchased right before i went on my trip to dubai and some of these items i purchased while i was in dubai i hope you guys enjoy if you are new here welcome if you enjoy the vibe please make sure to subscribe stay we do a little bit of everything here we do fragrances we have vlogs mental health videos we always have a dope prayer down in the description box so make sure you check that out if you are into it and i just don't want to waste any more time okay let's just get into it i'm super excited i didn't do this haul as soon as i got back for the simple fact that i really wanted to be able to talk about it i didn't want to just be saying oh yes and this smells nice and i bought this because it smells good no i wanted to be able to give y'all a vibe and the time and y'all know how i do it down over here i wanted to be able to give y'all the vibe the time and what's really good with it you know what i'm saying so let's get into it these two i actually purchased before i left for dubai so we have cavort and we have secretress secretress i have already discussed in my atl fragrances that i carry to atl i actually carried this as well to dubai i didn't show you guys the fragrances i carry to dubai i have planned on it never got around to it but secretress i have already talked about here on the channel cavort cavort is a boss once i smelled this fragrance i immediately pictured my mother it's so crazy i'm like this would just be so much of her speed this would be her get up when i first had the samples of both of these fragrances i thought cavort was the one that i resonated with more through wearing both of them i'm like nah secretress is definitely my body like i like this one and everything like that's why i have it in my collection i genuinely like both this for me is like when i wear new york fifth avenue if you guys are not new here new york fifth avenue for fragrance dubois is something that i wear when i want to feel my bossiest if i know i'm about to close deals i'm about to go to a meeting really try to pitch myself and really put myself in a new standing new york fifth avenue is one of those fragrances that i gotta have sprayed somewhere on me i don't know if i'm gonna spray a little bit into my hands and rub it on my pens before exams like if i really want to take myself to the next level new york fifth avenue for fragrance dubois is something that i have to have with me cavort is that next thing i love how special and bossy this fragrance makes me feel i want to share some of these fragrance notes with you guys saffron divana geranium cinnamon ylang-ylang rose orange blossom incense patchouli sandalwood honestly everything is just blended to perfection um i can't even lie to you guys about it the bottle also with these two from this line actually has changed a bit it's a little bit more rounded at the corners it's still beautiful to me i love the fact that um they they experience some color like it's a warm spicy woody amber that i feel you can use year round like i don't think there should be a specific point for this and that's what i really like about it it's a boss fragrance anytime you're feeling bossy just grab it you know you guys if you guys have smelled this just let me know what you think about it let me know if you get that bossy essence about it but the moment i smelled it i thought about my mom and the secretress secretress and Muni demi those two were the only things that i purchased before i went off to dubai the next one we have here is Hawaz for her. Um, I don't even remember where I bought this. I think I bought it in the sook. Woo! guys this is tropical fruity woody awesomeness like this fragrance and it has amazing longevity i'm not trying to spray it because it's not going to come off of me and i got events after this video but guys so safe like i really like Rosasi's products not only because they mix really well with other fragrances in my collection but also for the simple fact that they have amazing longevity like i love fragrances that just keep lasting i smell them on my clothes the essence of them still lingers i love that and with this one you definitely get that the notes in this fragrance are so fun. There's apple, pomegranate, grapefruit, praline, patchouli, vetiver. It's a very, very happy fragrance. If I know I'm going to have happy memories, like going to the carnival, going out for a really, really good time with friends, this is what I want to grab for. Guys, it's completely unisex. Anybody can wear it. Let's move on to the next one. The next one from Rasasi is also Kasama. Like, this was highly talked about on Instagram and also a little bit here on YouTube. But most of the time I saw this fragrance and it was on Instagram. And I was like, you know what? I love the Rasasi brand because I have some other fragrances from Rasasi but this one right here is so sweet guys that it's kind of like has a little bit of to me a resemblance to Kaali Vanilla with the way I mix it like Kaali Vanilla literally 
takes any fragrance to the next level while it's in any combo it's beautiful this is the same exact way like the same exact feelings i have for kaylee vanilla is the same exact feelings i have for this one it can be mixed beautifully with absolutely anything it's musky while being really sweet having sweet notes having vanilla i have another fragrance that kind of smells like this i think this is just the vibe of the uae when i smell it like there's this vibe and this is some this fragrance depicts that vibe for me even other fragrances that i already had in my collection this is kind of that same vibe they all kind of mix really really well together the other day i wore this in shagaf oud it was just so beautiful because this is just so sweet and it's like it was it was a day that it's like it's still a little chilly but it's not brick outside it worked okay it worked let's take a little break from fragrance if you guys watch my vlog you guys would have noticed that i stopped at white apple trading when i was over there and these are perfume oils concentrated perfume oils and i wanted to just share the way i really use it i have peach la via belle that's supposed to like smell like the actual la via belle which i have over here so when i wear this fragrance i always add the oil into my shea butter we have strawberry and we also have bubble gum so these are all of them um, i can't carry all every single one of them we're gonna use vanilla as the example okay i'm gonna leave all the details for this specific company down below but guys this right here has changed my fragrance game i used to just order oils from amazon and you know mix them with my vitamin e oil mix them with my shea butter but this concentrated oil lasts by far way longer than anything i've tried if i know i really want to smell woody and oriental vanilla is perfect if i want to smell sweet i would apply some bubble gum into the palm of my hands with some shea butter and rub it all over my body guys sometimes you can really do that and get away without wearing any perfume like if it's like a day like today that i don't have any perfume on right now um i just use a little bit of vanilla with my shea butter and rub it on my skin so i'm still have i still have a fragrant on me but until i'm ready to leave that's when i'm gonna spray on my fragrances and all that type of jazz you know what i'm saying so i wanted to definitely um talk about this it's not sponsored i use my own coins guys it's also really inexpensive it's the fragrance oils and the guy that actually owns the shop he was so sweet he packaged them all really really well for me um when i was leaving so traveling with them there was no issue guys the amount of excess luggage i had when i came back from dubai i had a total of five suitcases and it was only me hey let's not even get into the airport fiasco let's keep going the next one is one that i've also talked about in my atl vlog i can't carry all of them but this is the messiah perfume guys i'm gonna just have to leave the instagram page i think i said i was supposed to leave the instagram page the last time i'm not sure but i'm gonna leave the instagram page for this brand i can't find anything online about this brand i'm not going to talk about angel because i talked about angel in the atl vlog we have romantic the perfect name for it it kind of still has that same vibe as the rastasi fragrances but i still love it but it does have that vibe when i tell you guys i literally can't find anything online for this brand i don't know if it's me that's blind that's not checking well guys do you see the mister <laughs> gosh what does romantic smell like it's warm it has florals it's very deep i know there has to be some type of rose or something in here but it's just still it's still subtle i can't guys i feel so bad i can't really it's blended so well i can't really pick it out but it's so nice so 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 nice but those were the couple that i got from messiah perfume they were just a kiosk inside the mall of emirates so anytime i would stop into the mall i would just try to visit as many kiosks as i can um that's really what i was doing a lot of the time at night time i was just like eating walking around the mall finding different perfumes that i've never ever been able to smell um and stuff like that the next one that i'm like completely head over heels and i have so many so i didn't bring all out is the Anfas brand the presentation and the quality of each is what's like amazing these things are so heavy i have shagaf i have sadiq i believe i have messiah i have ishik that's kind of like a baccarat rouge type of vibe i ended up giving that gifting that because it's like i have so many of those type of things and you guys will see a lot of these in videos and stuff like that so that's why i'm just like you know if i know i've talked about them in the video i'm kind of just rushing through it because i talk about you know the same things the next one i don't even know why i'm cheating you guys out of the packaging let me show you guys the packaging let me be a real youtuber let me show you guys opulent shaik 
uh, I think I was in my old home. I had an aunt that had a fragrance from this brand. And I just loved how cool it was. And then Nika Marks here on YouTube, she talked about it, like one of her first videos here about it as well. And I was like, Nika, my aunt had that bottle on her dresser. And I always wanted to like have my own piece from them. So I saw it, I had bought this one and I bought one for my mom and I bought one for my boyfriend. I bought him the male one, his looks like a car, it's so cool. So this is how it comes, it's gorgeous. Like even when I wanna use it guys, I leave it all in this presentation. So this is Shaik Sapphire and I just need you guys to just take a moment and I have to keep it in this presentation because obviously this can't just you know that's the only thing about these beautiful bottles it's an issue when you want to store them so it's you can keep it in the case that they have inside or I can just keep the full presentation but yes it's just an issue when you want to store it but this is 10 of the best fragrance bottles ever I love when people do things out of the box and just do their own thing and this brand is like top tier when it comes to that they do their own thing it's crazy it's vanilla it's powdery but it's powdery but not the powdery that Whitney doesn't like you know like it has that roundup roundup oomph but it's not like disgustingly powdery there's some rose in here guys this one it's very special I feel like it's so elegant like I feel like I'm more inclined to use this for special occasions and I think it also has to do with like the way the bottle is represented I don't know are you guys like that let me know if y'all do that sometime like the fragrance per se is not so special like I feel like I have other fragrances in my collection that are really really special to me like they do something for me this one the bottle does a lot for me I'm just gonna be real the bottle does a lot for me the scent is not bad which makes it another plus the scent is not bad but the fragrance is just kind of like meh to me you understand what I'm trying to say like it's nice but like I said it's meh it's just like it's okay I like her you know we have helotrope peony rose it's nice but it's not umph you guys have been on this if you guys are not new here you guys know what's umph for me you guys know I love gourmands I love sweet I love it hot spicy and decadent that's what I love so for this it's cute or whatever but it's just not you know you you know if you know me it's I. Right. it's just I. Right. but the packaging in the bottle now that's a stunner <laughs> i'm a mess let's get on to the next one last but not least is kemi layla gosh when i talk about having um having vim taking you to the next level this is one of them that I'm talking about. This is so me. It's warm, spicy. It's sweet. It's vanilla. It's woody. It's just everything that I like. So this for me, even though the bottle is also unique as well, this for me is more of something that I gravitate to. I really love warm, spicy. I really love vanilla. I like cinnamon. If you're into that vibe, guys, you gotta tell me what you think about this. If you're really into that vibe, you know you like that type of aura, essence, blah, 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 the whole nine yards. You, If you're into that whole essence, that whole vibe, you have to get your nose on this. Because honestly, I really, really like it. Like, I love it. We have sweet notes. We have vanilla. We have nutmeg. We have musk, amber, patchouli, ylang, -ylang and clove. Guys, honestly... I guess sweet nose, I guess small, small ylang ylang and nutmeg in the beginning. And the nutmeg only lasts for a little bit of time on my skin. Really want to do a Kemi House review. But there's a lot of things I say I want to do, but honestly, I really do. I like this brand a lot. I love how they do things uniquely and the quality of their bottles. Like it's heavy. Like I can't say it's heavier than and fast, but they both have weight, okay? And I like that. We love when the fragrance is, you know, inexpensive and it does what it needs to do. It takes us to where it needs to take us to. We love that. But if it's gonna be expensive, we also love when it's given expensive. You understand what I'm saying? It's giving weight, it's giving quality, it's giving the best materials. We love that. We as in me, I am she guys this is what we love well that is all for my haul for at least the items that i kept into my collection the rest of the items that will be listed down below are gifts i ended up gifting them to my mom my siblings friends and the whole nine yards please make sure to thumbs up this video like comment and subscribe do all the fun things for me share me with a friend tell your friends to pull up and until my next video mwah, bye guys <laughs>